Hello everybody, this is Easy Ferris at Y4C, as I see again. Uh, I hope you liked our uh, previous video. Uh, it was very interesting. It was uh, about uh, fixing this helicopter I have right here, the uh, motors. It was a very nice video. Uh, today, I'm going to be almost like continuing something from that. Uh, I'm going to be soldering the antenna from the circuit board, as you saw in the uh, video. The antenna came off. So, I'm going to be showing you basically today how to solder an antenna onto the circuit board. It works for any vehicle really. Uh, maybe less for some vehicles from tracks. I don't know. But it will work for any vehicle like this. If you For any circuit board that needs an antenna. It will work for almost anything you want to sort of so solder. Saying that, I've made some videos on soldering already. So I'm not going to be showing the basic procedure of uh, soldering. I'm just going to be showing me soldering the circuit board. So it's very important to remember to take the batteries out of the way very expensive stuff out of the way, make sure there's no debris, you know, all that mumbo jumbo. Very important mumbo jumbo. And now I'll just go like that. And I'll get on with my soldering. Soldering always makes me nervous. Okay. So first step, we yeah, need a soldering tool. And and the sock. So, just waiting for this to heat up. Oh, it's already pretty hot. What you do? So, first I just heat up the soldering that's already on the board. So yeah, it's melting. Yeah, so at least it's melted a little. Now, get your antenna. Uh, figure out which side was connected in the beginning. So the side that was looks a little stripped like this side here. And get a uh, pair of scissors, or if you have a, another tool other than this, go ahead and just drip part of the wire off. There we go. This is all nice and tight. And now, with your uh, soldering tool, yeah, it's nice and hot, just uh, place some solder on it, let it melt in onto the soldering tool. You need a lot, especially for this connection. Take that, and now place it on the end of the, um, the thing here. Just do as I do. Let the what you put already dry a little. And then put some more. Enough. Now just place your wire. I'm going to move the camera actually. Got to be careful not to get the camera. Here, that's a perfect angle. 
that that's a perfect angle so now you can see there's the uh, here's the place where I'm soldering it to so now that I've placed some solder on uh, that's that wire I'm just gonna press down there and it will melt on first I'll heat up the this part here Then I'll uh, place this on. And it's simple as that, really. I'm done. Look at that. It's a perfect solder. Not bad, not bad. Look, I'm even pulling in. It's not coming off. Now put your soldering tool at a safe distance. Accidents always happen when you think it's victory. <laughs> Another important lesson. And I'll unplug my soldering tool. There we go. And there we go. It's done. Now it's for a test drive of the helicopter. Now that it's all uh, all fixed. Finally. I could actually do some action videos now. Flying. Ha! Oh, finally. Waiting for this for a long time. I used to be an expert uh, helicopter flyer, but I'm going to be a little rusty after all those years. Three years, I think. I haven't flown a proper helicopter. And this is only a Lighthawk XL. It's very easy to fly. It's not like the other helicopters I used to fly. I have a, I have a protocol. It's much, much bigger. Really, if there's any vehicle that I am really, really have an expertise in, or not expertise, that's the wrong word. Experience in, it's helicopters. Helicopters, I, I'm, I'm very confident with helicopters. Cars, I'm also pretty confident, but not as confident as the helicopters. Boats, I'm not as, uh, as confident, and airplanes, I am not as confident. Well, airplanes more than the boats. Boats are the least confident. There. Uh, that should do. And now, where's the cover for it? Here it is. So I'm going to move the helicopter right from here onto this table at the back because the soldering tool is still pretty hot and I don't want anything to be damaged. So it's on. It's perfect. I'm just going to check to make sure that you can actually see the helicopter. Because it might fly pretty high. Okay. And now for the remote. It's working. I'm just gonna adjust the uh, turning. Finally. Ah, bad landing. I told you I was rusty. Anyway, that's it. I, I'm done. Perfect soldering. Thanks for watching Wi-Fi Studios RC. I hope you liked the video. It was very fun for me. I'm very excited for the action videos for the Lighthawks XL. It's gonna be awesome. I'm afraid I can't put the uh, camera on board because the Atom HD isn't small enough. Uh, oh. It's also pretty heavy. I don't think it will work. Uh, hopefully, once I get that helicopter fixed, the big, big one, uh, I'll be putting the camera on and it's going to be epic, you know? So, thanks for watching. If you like the video, subscribe. If you have any comments, let me know. Uh, I'll see you next time. Goodbye.